Once a terrifying warlord from one of the original tribes of Noxus, Scion charged mercilessly into battle with the Damasians, despite his armies falling around him. He's killed, but not before he tears the crown of Jarvan I from his head and chokes the king to death with his bare hands. Metal. Noxus is not a place to let ethics get in the way of conquest, though, and former Grand General Boram Darkwell has the Black Rose reanimate Scion as an undead battle master. Trouble is, with his mind deteriorated and his rage amplified, Scion has a tendency to slaughter as many allies as enemies, and so eventually he is locked away in his tomb again with the losses decimate morale. And just Swain, who sees in Scion a valuable resource and who unearths him again to be deployed as a weapon of terror to punish Noxian territories that dare to rebel. Siren himself feels nothing anymore but painful fragmented memories and an unquenchable thirst for destruction and death, and a fading consciousness that he used to be more than a mere thing. As a design, Sion is pretty brilliant, honestly. The bloody furnace in his stomach makes him clearly artificial, the giant surgery scar makes him clearly undead, the dagger in his head with a streaming ribbon is a compelling visual, and the crown of Jarvan the first grafted onto his jaw is just badass. Sion is cool as hell, and I'm glad he's not doing a bad Arnold Schwarzenegger impression anymore. Subscribe to this channel for more reactions and hot takes, or head on over to my main channel for longer in-depth videos.